A doctor lies a COVID-19 patient on her stomach so she can breathe more easily and helps her clear her chest. Others try to comfort a man who's in pain. The patients in this hospital in Uttar Pradesh might be suffering, but in a state with only 125 beds for every 100,000 people, they're fortunate to be there. Less than 100 kilometers away from India's capital, New Delhi, residents of one village in Uttar Pradesh tell Al Jazeera, 40 people have died in the past three weeks. That includes the village pharmacist, who's refused admission to the nearest hospital 90 minutes drive away. His son explains what happened. Hospital mein bed khali nahi hai, oxygen ki problem hai. There were no beds available for him at that hospital. We tried other hospitals in the city, but they refused too. We took him to a nearby hospital in the district as his condition became worse, but there were no ventilators available and the doctor said that he had died. My father was a fit and strong person. He was just 45 years old. If he had treatment and oxygen, then perhaps he would have been alive. Although Sudhi Kumar's father couldn't find medical care, he was tested for COVID-19, a test others in the village haven't been able to get. Here people are getting a fever for a few days and suddenly they are dying. Almost every home has a member who's ill. Here, no COVID testing is happening. People are aware of the disease but don't have the means to get themselves tested. To do a test, they need to travel far and that isn't happening. When people are dying without a test, there's no death certificate either. Rameshwar Singh, who also lives in Chandraval village, says that's how his 80-year-old mother, Poolvati, died. She had fever two days earlier and when she heard that my brother had passed away in an accident, she fell further ill. The fever became worse. We couldn't take her to the city hospital. We didn't have time to even try and give her some treatment. This is the healthcare centre in Chandraval, but it's closed. 65% of India's population lives in rural areas, villages like Chandraval, where there are fewer public hospitals than in the cities. But India is facing a shortage not just of hospital beds and medical supplies, but healthcare workers too. We can't get ICU beds 400 or 500 like that. In, within few days of the, uh, within few days and within few weeks. So for that you tend, uh, staff, you need ten staff, ten medical personnel, ten technicians, ten uh, and a lot of equipments that cannot be catered within days and weeks. There is only one doctor for every 20,000 people in Uttar Pradesh. Hospitals in India's richest cities, including here in the capital New Delhi, have been completely overwhelmed by the surge in cases but it's widely believed that the situation is even worse in rural areas where most cases and deaths are underreported because of a lack in testing. Elizabeth Paranam, Al Jazeera, New Delhi.